the second beta release in the Ubuntu 12.04 development cycle is now available to download. So if you're curious as to what's new and changed, grab yourself a live CD or USB and boot it up. Most beta releases tend to be fairly stable and Ubuntu 12.04 Beta 2 doesn't buck this trend. The oft-criticised Unity interface now flies along like a hot knife through butter, and the new lineup of Unity lenses are also snappy at delivering up content. On the subject of lenses, Beta 2 sees Rhythmbox support added to the Unity Music Lens. Some people install apps and then don't know how to launch them. To help clarify things for new users, Ubuntu 12.04 includes an application installation animation when installing applications through the Ubuntu Software Center. The system settings pane now contains a few new items, including privacy controls for managing what applications and what kinds of files are logged by the Zeitgeist engine, a rather out of place quick installation button for Canonical's landscape client is also present, but most users will be keen to get down with the new customization controls for the Unity desktop. These offer the ability to change how the launcher behaves and how big or small it is. Multi-monitor users will appreciate some new configuration options available in Ubuntu 12.04, including an option to specify which monitor the Unity launcher should appear on, or whether it should appear on them all. But it's not all roses and doe eyes. The new look Ubuntu One desktop client sticks out like a sore thumb, having been rewritten in Qt to match the Windows client. No rundown of the precise pangolin will be complete without having a quick peek at the heads-up display. It's one of Ubuntu 12.04's leading features, although it is completely optional. Although once you've started playing with it, it's pretty difficult to imagine life without it. 